so I just I wanted to wrap. Is it something that that really RAP is only a Western Region Occupancy Project? We're only about a year and a half old, um, and one of and one of our our struggles and where we really need all of you and and the two organizations that co-sponsored me being here tonight. How do we separate? How do we break the separation of homelessness as being distinct and separate? from all of the other issues that impact our lives. Because it isn't, and it shouldn't be. And it's never gonna get addressed if it's a separate line item in the federal budget that is, that is distinct and separate from poverty, and it keeps us all weaker. I mean, we've watched public housing being decimated. And it isn't until very recently that public housing tenants and homeless people are joining forces to fight together. But I'm telling you, when you go from public housing to losing your unit, you're not six weeks away from being homeless. You're, you're out in the street pretty quick. If you were poor enough to be living in public housing in the first place, the chances are you're ending up in the street when you lose that unit. And that's true in so many other areas. Education, access to health care. You know, when we talk about the health care dilemma in America, and then we talk about the homeless crazy people as separate from that, that's just not going to cut it. We're not going to... We continue to allow ourselves to be separated. And so to see a sustainable communities group and a, and a unitarian group and a homeless organization, you know, coming together to say, no, we're gonna all talk about this together and learn from each other. Next time I'll shut up and I'll sit out there and somebody else can talk about the other issues so that each one is each one <laughs> is really the way that we go and build community um, is, is the biggest challenge I think that faces us. And working with real change and forming those kind of alliances, I think, is what ultimately we won't be here celebrating the 40-year anniversary of McKinney. You know, we'll be talking about that horrible period of time when we didn't know what the hell we were doing until we learned how to address it. And that's really the ultimate goal, and I think that's what's going to ultimately change it. Um, and I just wanted to thank you all.